Hello, this is Lauren Kelly, Digital Services Librarian at Niles Main District Library. Today, we're going to talk about how to get started with Mango Languages. Use this free language learning app to learn phrases, improve your vocabulary, and develop conversation skills. Mango offers over 70 world languages, including English. Here's how to get started. On a laptop or desktop computer, visit nileslibrary.org. Click Research to see all of our online resources. We know we're looking for Mango, so we can click M for Mango Languages. Then click the link. Enter your library card number to access the page. Once you're on the Mango Languages page, you're going to sign up for an account. If you already have an account, simply click Log In. You can also use Mango as a guest and not create an account, but know that your progress will not be saved. I'm gonna click Sign Up. Enter an email address and password of your choosing, and remember your password so that you can log in later. Agree to the terms and services. You can scroll through and read those in detail if you would like. Once you've created an account, you will be welcomed to the Mango Languages page. You can choose a language that you would like to start learning. I'm gonna choose Spanish. Go ahead and click Start Learning to go through all of the lessons. Mango is uh, really convenient that it gives you a walkthrough before you get started. And so on. You can see the different chapters of learning, for instance, connections, community, lifestyle. You can also scroll to see specific conversation topics. This one might be useful for me, Spanish for librarians, but there's also business and legal. Over on the left side, you can see how many chapters and lessons are within each module. And you can bounce around and really go at your own pace for your own learning. If you already have some uh, of the language in your brain already, you don't have to start at the very beginning you can go to exactly what you would like to learn. You can always choose a different language by going to the back arrow and then choosing a different language. You can search for a language if you would like uh, or scroll through popular languages here. Start learning. There's also the explore tab. Some of these have films that you can watch to help you hear the language spoken in context. There's also a Google Translate built-in tool right here in Mango Languages. Let's go ahead and look at the mobile version. Once you've downloaded the Mango Languages app from your app store, this is what it will look like the first time you open it up. Again, you can choose to sign up if you do not yet have an account, or you can click log in. Since I already entered my information when I signed up via the web, I'm gonna go ahead and enter my information here. And enter your password that you chose when you created your account. And we're in. Choose your notification settings if you're on an iPhone. And we're right back where we started. It knows that I was doing the Spanish Latin American and that I was on chapter one. However, I can switch which language I would like to use by going up to the top left corner and choosing a language here. This looks quite similar to the website with each um, chapter and learning module laid out. Mango is super easy to use. It has a really intuitive interface, and we hope that you can get started learning a new language soon. You can also access the Mango Languages help page by clicking support. Visit our support page. If you're having any issues with Mango Languages, there are many answers here. If you have any questions about how to utilize Mango Languages or any of our digital resources, 
You can contact the Digital Services Department by emailing us at dsdesk, that's D-S-D-E-S-K, at nileslibrary.org. Thanks for joining me today. Adios.